Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. Hope you are all doing very well. Welcome to another vlog, another day in my life. It was a weekday but I had to take a day off because I was unwell and I also had an appointment that morning. On my way back decided to grab some groceries and as always tempted to buy those beautiful flowers. Brioche is my favorite kind of bread and I like to grab them whenever I want to have french toast or something like that. This reminded me of the dense winter cake that I baked last year and also the fact that I haven't started any baking this year at all. Back home and decided to make some brunch. If I'm not keeping well, I always like to eat food which is very comforting and for me comfort food are those which I grew up eating. So in this vlog you will watch me making recipes, food which reminds me of my home, reminds me of my childhood. I hope you'll enjoy. So the other day I received my Black Friday order which is nothing but a KitchenAid chopper. This is a mini chopper. It was on sale, I think it was priced at 90 euros and I bought it for 60 euros. I shall put the link of this product in the description box so you can check. I decided to use this chopper for everything that I'll make today. I grew up eating this for breakfast, for evening snacks, for school tiffin, so this is very much nostalgic for me and I always like to finish it with black salt and a bit of ketchup. Let me know in the comments if you also eat dim paroti like this.
Momo loves eggs too, so it's a snack time for her as well. And of course I had to take her out after that. But I wouldn't lie, I like that too. I really enjoyed the fresh air outside. Although it was a day off for me, but I had to attend few meetings. Once those were done, Momo and I decided to take a nap. Like a really good nap. So evening time now and I decided to make some tea. So the other day I grabbed this Turkish series and look at those, how pretty are they. I was already feeling quite well after the nap but this amazing Darjeeling tea and a nice little surprise instantly lifted my mood. The surprise was this advent calendar. So finally I have an advent calendar for this year and this is from L'Occitane. Wasn't really expecting this but who doesn't like a gift? And was blown away how beautiful the calendar itself is. Look at the artworks. And I of course love their products, super excited for advent this year hence eagerly waiting for December 1st now. So my dull sick day took a nice little turn and I'm glad it did. So making another comfort food of mine which is nothing but home style fish curry. This is a very basic like jo everyday banta hai, that kind of fish curry and it's my go-to whenever it comes to comfort food super easy started with marinating the salmon with a little bit of turmeric salt and mustard oil fried them until they're nicely smeared from all the sides again using my chopper Onion, garlic, bit of ginger and green chilies. Adding cumin seeds, cardamom pods and cinnamon in the leftover oil. Sauteed the onion, green chilli, ginger garlic mix until they are light brown. Making a spice mix with basic masalas like haldi, red chilies, dhania powder, cumin powder with a little bit of water. At this point, I added a bit of Kashmiri red chilli and very little sugar. Also adding some chopped tomatoes. The one additional step which makes this recipe extra extra special and very much home like is this cinnamon powder, the fresh dalchini powder that I add at the end. 
I think whenever I'm sick, good food instantly makes me feel happy. It's not the medicines, it's the food that works for me. What about you guys? Let me know as well. I had also prepared a quick dal makhani. Shall share the recipe sometime later. And just look at this. If you haven't tried matcher jol like this, do give it a try and let me know how it goes. In case you have liked my video, don't forget to hit the like button. That will motivate me a lot. And subscribe to my channel if you want to watch similar kind of videos. And you can also click the bell icon to be notified for any future uploads of mine. See you in the next one very soon. Until then, bye bye.